go. If I can get these tame, that would be fantastic. Or killed, you know, whatever. Saros here, back with a new video. Originally, this would be episode three, but we recorded two episodes, and uh, well, it will speak for itself. Let's just play the beginning of, it, uh, of episode one right here. What's going on, guys? Saros with the uh, with waffles. With the boys. Alright, so now that you've seen that, uh, let's, um, well, to say the least, let me explain. <laughs> so as you heard there, the audio on my part was going through my webcam. So right now, it's telling me that it's going through my, uh, my good microphone right here. You can't see it. It's a blue snowball. My bad. I made a mess. But, uh, yeah, so now it should be going through there, and uh, well, to say the least, um, it, it's as you heard, it's just terrible. You couldn't really understand me half the time. Uh, yeah, in episode two, it was the same thing. Plus, I started getting some frame drops towards like the beginning of it, so I switched over to my hardware. But the file didn't save. Otherwise, I would have just uploaded that as episode one. So we're just going to continue with the plan. And say, because I wanted to do like a little building thing for episode one. That's not stopping me. So just let me give you a little bit of a tour. But wait. Wait. Guys. Guess what? Right. Right there. Right, I see it right there. Right there. You'll see a logo. And it says... ArcServers.io ArcService.io is no specific ArcServer.io It is the top Best Top 3 Top zip, top 1 Number 1 Server hosting company Cheap, affordable Plans are minimal so like you don't have to like decide on anything There's only 2 plans and that's player uh, size It's 60 players for $14 a month 50 cents for some backups. Amazing deal. You can get a server for $15 a month. Now, I don't know about you, but that is pretty impressive. If you want to go check them out, link in the description or use to, or use code intestine for I think it's 20, 25, 30% off your first month. Uh, something like that. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, so uh, now that that's out of the way. Jeez. Uh, yeah, this this series is sponsored by uh, ArcService.io. So yeah, let me give you a little tour of the base. So we come out here, right? This is the front, obviously, right? You know, got that. Got the green obelisk over there, red over there. Is that green? I thought that was blue. What? Where's the blue? Oh, that's interesting. But yeah, so I'm thinking about like doing a little bit of base design, you know, pizzazz. Says, but yeah, see, so, you know, we got this base defense wall here. It goes all the way around, or at least it will. I don't know if I finished it on that side yet. But I might do that today. Got the wall in my pocket here. But yeah, and then this is the front door. Definitely gonna do something about this to where it's just not a wall. If we go on inside, then we can make a few options, right? You can either go into the personal quarters. Or you can go into the dino storage. Let's just go check it out. Oh, it looks like Waffles got busy importing his dinosaurs. Which also tell me if you're okay with that. Because honestly, I wasn't okay with it, like, at first. Uh, because they're from Genesis. And I mean, we already went ahead and imported our survivors, which I think is just... Yeah, you know, I think I can just cut the line there. For, like, a new series, you know? But yeah, that that's just my opinion. 
tell me what you think in the comments. Uh, and uh, yeah, if, if if you guys think that they should like go back and export their dinosaurs or something, then yeah, because like the, they brought Magnus Rose and everything. I went ahead and brought mine as well, just in case. But I I wasn't planning on importing it anytime soon. Put in demolished ladder. But yeah, so this is a nice tall dino storage dinosaur gate. Anything you know big enough can come through. And then we got the crafting room. The little back door action. We got the refining forges, smithy, all that good stuff. And then back to the personal quarters, and then we got Waffles' room. And then we also have my room. Very empty. And then we got a uh, little. little area up here to access. And then we got storage over here. It's gear. And some roof action. But, uh, yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and finish the wall and, uh, well, I'll be right back. Alright, guys, so yeah, this just kind of came to my mind. Uh, if you want me to, like, continue this series, you know, just me recording it, because, I mean, yeah, you know, I was planning on editing all of them anyways, but I've been getting some comments and just people telling me that whenever it's all three of us, that you can't necessarily understand who's talking. Now what I was going to do to fix that was I was going to add subtitles just like on the bottom of the screen, but that is just way too tedious with my editor, uh, with my editing software. So unless I hire someone to do that for me, well, that's definitely not going to happen anytime soon. So yeah, so like let me know in the comments like what you think, uh, like spe spe specifically for this series. Because honestly, I was probably just going to continue doing it alone because uh, Zekrom and Waffles just... Could, yeah, I see right there, man. So. Zekrom and Waffles tend to communicate to each other more than they do with me. So really, it's just them talking about like Dead by Daylight or Warframe, like just completely off-topic stuff. Uh, and then like not even close while you just see my point of view for the entire thing. So uh, yeah, and then obviously I'm not rude, so I don't interrupt or anything like that. But yeah, so just leave me down uh, in the comments your opinion, based on it all. Oh, I need to get a ramp. I need to make a bookshelf. <laughs> See, I'm hoping to like, get started on like, the, uh, ooh, actually. Structure, oh, wait, yeah, no, I don't structures. Wood, storage, yeah, that. <laughs> Adobe. Of course, you know, play. Alright, there we go. So, yeah, I'm kind of thinking, like, maybe right there. Is that a good off? Yeah, okay, so yeah, that's good. And then. Ladder right there, and the trap door right there. Yeah, perfect. And we're into the storage room. Yeah, it's pretty great. Don't you think? <laughs> okay. And then the ramp. Place it right there. Go ahead, get some water. I mean, I could use some meat as well. Uh, but I'm mainly going at it for the hide. Ooh. What level are you? Level 6, not too bad. Might as well uh, get some taming action, you know? If we can. Yeah, you run now. There we go. 17 arrows. Look at the dang berries, come on. It looks like you're getting some yellow berries today. Let me go ahead and put all my clay in there. And then let's go ahead and go get some metal. 
I mean, maybe I can actually get to taming something, you know, like a RG or something. Something of great value and size. Because I've been thinking about like making just like kind of a story, like a, a story video for like originally, like the entire storyline. Because there's a pretty intense storyline for Ark, like the very beginning. You don't know your male. Males are useless. At least until I get a female, they are. White supply drop. That surprised me that there's actually a white supply drop even over here. Let's see so let's get some of this sick metal. Uh, I can make a crossbow actually. I should probably start working on that. But I mainly want to get a bunch of metal. That way I can get a generator and, of course, but we're gonna need some oil actually. So I need to get a flyer because I know where an oil vein is. But Zekrom said that he found one as well, so I'm gonna go ahead and harvest the oil if he if I can find out where he did find one. Get that oil, make some gas, get up a generator, and then make an industrial forge. That is my entire goal, is to make an industrial forge. That, that might be for next video though. Alright. And guys, for those of you who are watching this, who watched the aisle video, uh, tell me if you're liking the uh, the way that I'm editing it. Because I might do the same way with this video. Same editing style. Ooh, salt. Clay. This actually isn't that half bad. Ooh, Ooh an apprentice bow. Go ahead and eat up some berries. Now I don't starve. Then I'm, maybe I can try to get this Archie. Jesus, don't do that. Come on. Oh, why am I stuck? What the heck? Crap! That's gay! Run. If I can get these tamed, that would be fantastic. Or killed, you know, whatever. Is the damage that much that it actually just kills them? Dang it. Killed it last second. I'll just tame both of you. I already have one, but I mean, heck. You know, another one doesn't hurt. This bow might actually be too strong. Maybe. I'm going to have to go get some more berries, though. Come on. Stop running from me. You're literally a predator. for all of you soon. Alright. Saddles. Actually, generator. There it is. Electronics, metal ingot. So I need a tech dinosaur. To, I need to kill that. And I'll be good. There's metal I can do. 
Yeah, I could just go ahead and import that right now. Oh, even then I still need a fabricator. Darn, I can't escape it. Yeah, so that's definitely have to be like a later video, you know? Yeah, so I'll definitely start to work on the storage room as well. But I could probably start like an a, uh, electronics farm in ways of like, you know, taming two tech, like parasaurs, raising up a child, <laughs> and then killing it, harvesting it. It's so morbid that it might work. All right. So yeah, we, we're pretty protected from just random dinosaurs that might come over. See? I'm gonna, gonna tame you. I'm gonna try. It might have just been my chance to, uh, obviously, you know, get some element, but instead I used that opportunity. So now you gotta protect me. There we go, getting some wood. Female. I need a male. So let's just start naming you. Actually, you know, I'll let you guys name them. So we got a level 19 female raptor, level 29 male raptor, and then a level 12 male raptor. So make sure you specify. Level 9, oh, Rocky, that was already named. A level 24 tech raptor, nice blue, I mean, not blue, a nice red color with a, a white spike. So a white ambience. Level 79 saber tooth male, 14 female ankylosaur. A 32 male ankylosaur and a 14 female ankylosaur and I'll go ahead and level them up that way you know their actual levels there we go so you turn to level 34 uh, stand up for you Health. so 19 37 or 30 yeah 37 and 34 and then Sabretooth is male Raptor use an upgrade. And then I'll just leave the other how they are. So yeah, I'll let you guys name them. But uh, other than that, that's going to be it for this video. I hope you enjoyed. Remember to check out Ark servers if you want your own gaming server. They do Rust, Seven Days to Die, Ark, especially Ark, uh, Minecraft they're working towards, and Atlas they're working towards. And then they're just, you know, slowly expanding. They're, they're relatively new, maybe about an, an, uh, a, about a year and a half, two years old. So not that uh, old at all. They're relatively new. But yeah. Also, guys, I'm going to be working on some brand new ARC designs. If you got any ideas, be sure to leave them down in the comments. Or if you got any ideas for a, a new logo, if you want to see that, leave that down in the comments as well. But uh, yeah, thank you so much for staying till the end. Uh, I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.